Yeah, so we better do a bit of a, a timeline update, just a short one, um, as I'm catching up with stuff. <clears throat> so um, I'll just do a quick rundown on uh, second core. This one, second core gives you all three raptures, um, and the first two are pretty much the easiest. So you see here, he says, "I knew a man in Christ." All right, so this is. This man is in Christ. Okay, so like the centre cross, you got the three crosses. You got the one on on the right, the thief. The one on the left, the Jew, the Judah. All right. So most people in the world want to be um, the thief on the cross. They want to be him. All right. Um, he gets the free gift. But uh, these ones here are in Christ. They're on the centre cross. All right. And. Uh, the difference is those in Christ are born again and they've given up sin. They don't, they, you know, they uh, they fight against it continually. They have no more addictions. They've given up their addictions, and the ones they do have, they might battle against one or two or something. Um, but they're they're that they're in Christ. Okay, it says a new man in Christ above fourteen years ago. All right, so he's in the future fourteen years. All right, it says 14 years ago, and it's just above 14 years. It's not above 15 years, right? It's not above 13. It's just above 14 years ago. All right, so I'll, I'll show you why this is important in a minute. Such a one was caught up to the third heaven. All right, take note of third heaven. And I knew such a man. All right, such. Such is, I've got such, kind of, sort of. He's, he's kind of like, sort of like this man here, right? He's sort of like that. How he was caught up to paradise. See that? Paradise. This one's third heaven. This one's paradise. They are not the same place, all right? These are not the same place. How he was caught up to paradise and heard unspeakable words, all right? So there's unspeakable words for this man, who's this one here, which is not lawful. So what's not lawful? not lawful is lawless all right so he was a lawless man all right with unspeakable words and this guy went to paradise all right so he's like the thief he went to paradise okay now so we'll have a look here <clears throat> so you got your um you got your luke Mark and Matthew. So Matthew will run right through tribulations, all right? So when I was saying above 14 years ago, all right, so you got seven years of seals and seven years of trumpets, all right? So above 14 years is here, all right, in the Manelial reign. So Paul is looking from the Manelial reign. Now, those of you that are going on a buy about judgment judgment day and all that sort of stuff and the judgment resurrection that is after this this is after that thousand years it's right at the very end it's the last thing to even think about don't even need to worry about that that's still a long way away all right <clears throat> this is the first resurrection in front here just here this is where the dead in christ rise first and those that are alive and remain all right so those that are alive and remain that's your um, your rapture there. That's that one. Now, so you've got <clears throat> at the start here, at the beginning of the 14 years. So you have your white horse that rides, all right, which is the son of man. And he comes for 40 days, right, because this wicked generation will get no other sign than the sign of Jonah, right? So he goes through the streets of Jerusalem warning them to flee because it's going to get destroyed. All right, they haven't let the land rest. Um, he's going to destroy the land and kick them off. Okay, so Jerusalem will get attacked and destroyed. Okay, and they're all out of there. That's when the red horse rides. All right, so that's when you know that's in in the gear. As soon as you see uh, Jerusalem at the end of those forty days, well, it's actually fifty, but at the end of those forty days, um, and you see Jerusalem destroyed, you you will know the red horse is off. All right. You're into it. This is full on. It's all going to start happening. So you got your World War Three. So your bear, um, <clears throat> your lion is like Syria. Um, the bear will join the lion. Um, the bear is known as the Gentile destroyer of Gentiles. 
um, this is the only one that can take on like the rest of the um, rest of the other Gentiles right so this is the one that'll kick butt um, and then you've got your famine of food and the word so you won't be able to have the Bible or that sort of stuff right you'll also have food famine right um, so you have a false prophet comes down here uh, your beast is given power all right so and th these things this is the mark timeline here all right so you've got <clears throat> you got Luke Luke is the old wheat all right which is like the Leah bride those of you that know the story of um, of Jacob when he went, went and got uh, Leah, Leah and Rachel and he worked a, he worked a, actually 21 years right 21 years is like the story of uh, creation if you think about it this is all this is the same thing so 7,000 years 7,000 years and 7,000 easy years this is the easy years right so when he went away to work and he come back to get his bride he ended up getting Leah all right the older one the old wheat so he got Leah but then he wanted but he really wanted Rachel so he had to work another seven seven years all right this was a bit more stressful for him so he worked uh, another seven years to get Rachel and then he had to work another seven years for the father all right and he was going to get the cattle and all that left over so this is how you can see the uh, the story in that all the, all the stories in the Bible you got to look for these sort of things all right so um, they're all examples of of creation from the beginning to the end it's amazing it's amazing anyway so you'll see there the 144 um, K get sealed um, this is Rachel 144 get sealed and um, oh uh, sorry all that this lot here be Rachel this is the uh, great multitude rapture all right they don't die these ones don't die these ones here die right the dead in Christ they get martyred and all that sort of stuff um, <clears throat> So where, where was I? Yeah, this lot here. There's a rapture group that come out of this. Uh, the bride, first lot, the bride. Um, some go to the third heaven. Uh, some stay to go through seals and they get breathed on like Acts, right? So it's like Acts 2.0. Uh, they get breathed on so they can bring in the great multitude, all right? And the 144 get sealed so they can bring in the grapes you see how it works all right so that goes in they bring in this lot uh, this lot here no number can you know this you, you can't count how many's there all right but this lot you can count you can see there's ten thousand times ten thousands um <clears throat> so yeah they, they bring in this lot um and uh then this about this area here is where you get your temple built all right through here along this way the foundation will get built somewhere it'll stop and start because of war and all that sort of stuff so it'll take a while and Mount Zion comes down all right so Mount Zion I think it actually comes down around about here somewhere uh, Jesus is actually here Je the, this Messiah is you'll, you'll hear the two messiahs you've got Ben um, Messiah Ben Joseph and then you got Messiah Ben David, all right? And you don't get Ben David until after the two witnesses are killed, all right? There's a very good reason for that. Um, you, you'll figure it out. Now, so the temple is built here, and you'll see um, the woman flees for 1260 days while the city streets and the temple are built, all right? So, a woman being Judah. Um, and just before the pits are open, this one here flies away for times, times, and half a time. All right, this is the on the wings of an eagle. All right, so that that's that's a sideways rapture. It's not an actual like one of the other ones. And I'm sure there'll be like little raptures going on, people getting moved to places and all that sort of stuff. So um, you you get the people that are saying, you know, no such thing as rapture or whatever. <clears throat> well call it whatever word you like they get moved from one place to another <laughs> that's basically it so rapture is not death it's it's being transferred from one place to another All right, um, 
So what else didn't I mention there? So you got the Ben David. Um, so yeah, this area here is the Ben Joseph up to here, and from there you've got your line of Judah this way, Ben David, and this way is the Lamb, still the Lamb. All right. Um, <clears throat> uh, the, so yeah, this lot here, Rapture. This lot here, Rapture. Uh, this lot here, Dead in Christ. All right, Dead in Christ rise here, and they rule and reign for this thousand years. All right, they they that's why they um, they rose first to help Jesus rule and reign. All right, so there's still going to be a world going on outside of this this area sort of thing. So there's going to be uh, the kings in the world, and you'll see there at the very last part of Matthew, there's a great commission. Right, Matthew goes all the way to the end here. So you'll see in Matthew was it 28 or whatever it is, the Great Commission. That's where he sends them out to go and teach, right? So they're all out there, sends the Jews out, right? So Judah, to go out and teach. And um, they inherit the earth. So they're out there doing their thing there. And uh, they don't no longer need to preach because everybody knows that Jesus is here and who he is, right? There's just no mistake in it. So they're no longer preaching. They're going out to teach, all right? Um... <clears throat> And that's that's that area. Uh, what else? I forgot there was something else I was going to whack in there. But anyway, um, there's some more details down the bottom here. I don't know if you can see it. You can zoom in and save that. But that has some of the, the verses there or whatever. Anyway, God bless. I hope that helps.